Welcome to Lasea class. I am your teacher, Jan Lasea. Today I will show you my simple project, Spider Robot. The Spider Robot has six legs, joined by servo motors to its body. Its head has ultrasonic sensor and RGB LEDs. Its brain is the Arduino Uno microcontroller and it is Wi-Fi controlled. The materials needed to build this simple project are number one, Adept Hexapod Spider Robot Kit. The company name Adept Sales Robotics Kits online. and Arduino C, C++ IDE to compile and upload programs for the Arduino Uno microcontroller. The features of the Spider Robot are it can be controlled by a Wi-Fi using smartphone or personal computer. And it has obstacle avoidance and gravity balance control. Let us proceed to the spider robot kit. These are the parts of the spider robot kit. First, we have the black acrylic plates that forms the body and legs of the spider robot. Next, the Arduino Uno driver board microcontroller that forms the brain of the spider robot. We have the ultrasonic sensor. Next, we have the ESP8266 Wi-Fi module. We have the MPU6050 gyroscope accelerometer and magnetometer module battery holder for two 18650 lithium ion batteries two 18650 lithium ion batteries next we have the WS2812 RGB LED module Next, we have 14 pieces of servo motors. Next, we have several sizes of nuts, several sizes of nylon columns, two winding pipes, we have a ribbon, screwdrivers and wrench, Next, we have several sizes of screws, tapping screws, three pins and four pin wires. Lastly, we have the USB cable for uploading codes to the Arduino Uno from personal computer. The company name Adept provided the example source codes from their website in which I downloaded. Let us look at the codes. The file hexpad.h contains the class name quanroop and it contains constructor, destructor, methods, the file hexpad.cpp contains now the definition of the constructor, destructor, and methods.
the file angle.h contains constant memory variables for the 12 angles of the servo motors. And then finally, the file spider robot contains now the stage where it instantiated the class object quant loop alongside with global memory variables, methods, and so on. This is the place where the communication from smartphone or personal computer will communicate to the Arduino Uno via a Wi-Fi. It took me two days to assemble the spider robot. Ladies and gentlemen, let us run and test.
that ends our simple project for today. I hope you are inspired in my class. Thank you for watching. God bless us.